relationships I'm um, it's like yeah been through a lot um the biggest part that I find to be the biggest like problem with relationships is that if you definitely have a person that's not for you it's just gonna be horrible and um I've ran into a couple situations where I just got with a girl because she made me feel good and then I realized oh I hate this girl in high school, like, you shouldn't really expect anybody to care that much because it's high school. Like, who's going to take it that seriously, especially relationships? And I did have a boyfriend for seven months, but it didn't work out. Like, I thought that, oh, like, if we ever break up, I'm going to be so sad. And nope, when we broke up, I was pretty content. Like, I, it didn't really bother me that much. And I realized it's because, like, we weren't really meant to be together. We just, I don't know. I was in a relationship. Um, I think it was like last year. I thought that he was like into the relationship, but then you know, some people can be very deceiving. He like made me think like he's not like that. He is a nice guy. And that kind of like messed me up a little because I didn't know like it hurt being with him and it hurt to leave him. So I didn't know what to do. So I just waited for him to choose. I would say it all started when all my friends were getting into relationships. I kind of felt like the odd one out because I was just kind of there, like third wheel in it, and it just, I don't know, it wasn't the best. But then once I got into a relationship this past year, it's changed me. I always felt like I wasn't good enough. I was always trying to be somebody I wasn't because this person expected so much but never took anything I offered and once we finally ended things it was like this guilt and pressure and stress was lifted off my shoulders yes I was sad because I lost my best friend but it was something that needed to happen I needed to let go and we just weren't good for each other anymore Freshman year, I started talking to a girl. She was like, whatever, whatever I want to talk to her, it was just, she was just there. She didn't care for me or anything, you know, it was just like a high school thing. And when she broke up with me over the phone, which was stupid, when that ended, I didn't have any feelings. You learn who you are, you learn what you want from all these relationships, you know, that people get into, whether you're talking to girls or actually dating. You learn a lot about yourself. So when I look at relationships in high school, I kind of think of it as a learning experience. And I mean, that's really it. Um, any advice I have to people that want to get into a relationship is um, make sure you know what you're getting into. Um, I would say be more aware of uh, your relationship, don't let, um, don't be really jealous because that can actually push some guys away. Don't be like super, super jealous and don't be way too overprotective and try to give him some space at least once in a while or her once in a while. If you are going to get in a relationship, you, if you can wait, just go to college. Getting into a relationship in high school is a big commitment and you have to be prepared for the moodiness of both people. If a girl says, says, be my girlfriend, the second day you know her, 